Assalamu alaikum. Good afternoon, Bristol. My name is Tim Wiles. I am a uh, volunteer duty manager at the Wild Goose Cafe, which is a drop-in centre for homeless people on Stapleton Road in Bristol. And uh, I'm here with Bushrat Ali. Ali is one of the most uh, is one of the hundred most influential uh, speakers in the UK. He's also a special representative for the United Nations, and he is a human rights activist. And he is a resident of Stapleton Road here in Bristol. Ali, it's a pleasure to be in your house here with you. Thank you. So, many people in Bristol may have seen this leaflet circulating. Um, I've seen this one. It says, Hi, Clifton Place PS5 neighbour. Are you unable to leave your home because of COVID-19, coronavirus? We are here for you. Um, could, you uh, could you tell us a little bit about um, what this leaflet is about and uh, how people can get help if they need it? First of all, thank you for giving me the opportunity to give my view to the, your audience as this is my city and this is my country they've done so much for us mm. and this is time to pay back to the community mm. so that's why me and my few friends we organize this group mm. and come in the front line to help people in need mm. we start with a free food delivery mm. Then we extend our help mm. to free grocery shop. Sure. Further, we extend to give a loan, short term loan. And if people and families in urgent need or they are moneyless, mm. we provide free grocery shop as well, grocery shopping and to them. And especially in BS5 area, but generally in Bristol, anywhere. Mm. We distribute more than 1,500 these leaflet door to doors and different shops and on Facebook and WhatsApp and all the social media. We also share this idea with the local mayor, Marvin Rees, mm. and MP Kerry McCarthy, mm. and uh, different organizations. That's excellent. That's excellent. Um, thank you very much. And uh, I was just wondering, um, uh, Ali, if you don't um, mind telling us, how is this funded? Well, uh, it is, we are not NGOs, we don't get donation from anywhere, even from not United Nation, but uh, from close family friends and family members. Mm. We get this donation uh, from them and they help us to carry on this uh, campaign. Surprisingly, we never ever appeal for donation. People know we are doing this. Yes. So they are donating without our asking. People donate mask, mm. this hand wash, mm. uh, gloves, food, mm. rice, everything, whatever they can, they are giving us. But we are not asking donation, but anything is welcome to help our community. Excellent, excellent, excellent. And do you have any idea how much longer you'll be doing this? Uh, we will carry on this to till this crisis is not finished. Mm. We will do this continuously for our community. Excellent, excellent. Thank you very much, Ali. You're welcome. So what we've seen there is we've seen that um, uh, though governments and NGOs are very important in uh, protecting the vulnerable and in crises like these, we've seen that individuals can also be remarkably, uh, uh, remarkably important in that um, uh, in that work. So I've had some people asking about um, uh, homeless people in Bristol and rough sleepers in Bristol. What provision is being made available for them? So, this is a constantly changing situation, but it's being managed centrally by the organization Caring in Bristol via a Facebook page called the COVID-19 Caring in Bristol Homeless Provision Group. You can find us on Facebook, or if you need to, uh, if you can't find it on Facebook, then uh, please send one of us a text message. Our numbers will appear later. Um, however, if you are out and about, and you do happen to see individual homeless people, then you can be helpful, providing you keep safe distance to protect you and them, to give them some signposting advice. You can print off this, this is from the COVID-19 Facebook group I mentioned earlier, you can print off this list, this table, of the services which are available each day. Now this is constantly changing, um, but if you keep up to date, you can have this on your smartphone or you can print out a copy. You can show it to homeless people or give them a copy, and they will know where they can get food on each day. 
Other than that, um, I'll give you an example. The Wild Goose Cafe is running a pop-up lunch on Mondays, Wednesdays, Thursdays and Fridays at 10.30 till 12.30. And all of these services are takeaway only. We have one uh, request for donations and that is for fruit. Uh, if you would like to donate fruit at all to the homeless or rough sleepers in Bristol, then please text the word fruit to 07791355394. That's 07791355394. And above all, please keep trusting in God, remaining calm, and praying confidently for the vulnerable in this time of crisis. Thank you very much for your time.